Welcome to the series of S4HANA product management on air. My name is Sven Deneken and I'm heading the SAP S4HANA product management team. Today we will give you an overview of the cloud updates planned for the first quarter of this year, 2017. In February, SAP will provide the next quarterly updates to the following three solutions from the SAP S4HANA cloud family. SAP S4HANA Finance Cloud 1702, a package designed to run your company's finance department and beyond. SAP S4HANA Professional Service Cloud 1702, which covers everything from project management to professional service automation. And SAP S4HANA Enterprise Management Cloud 1702, our next generation SaaS ERP to run your entire company end to end, from finance to procurement to logistics, and of course, much more. Let me start with SAP S4HANA Finance Cloud. Finance is again a major topic for this release. And let me tell you, finance is ready for the public cloud. With this release, customers are now able to take advantage of machine learning innovations, which help them to reduce manual efforts and enhance their daily business. Another feature of this release to mention is the new functionality for intercompany processes for cost allocation in general ledger. This functionality enables accountants to reduce the effort during intercompany cost allocation. Finance Cloud also includes selected procurement and order management capabilities that help customers to expand with other SAP Cloud solutions, with the integration of, for example, Concur or, for example, payments are much, much accelerated. The last release of our Professional Service Cloud continues the pattern of innovation across line of business to help customers efficiently manage their end-to-end -end professional service automation. One feature I want to mention is the financial integration of accrued expenses. With this function, the need to separate expense billing is removed, thereby supporting end-to-end -end project billing processes. The new function of project revenue planning improves tracking and decision-making in projects. Customers are now provided with more revenue analysis and comparison possibilities. All those innovations are available in S4HANA Enterprise Management Cloud 2, but let me add a few that are coming directly and specifically with our ERP Cloud solution. First, an update to the line of business sales with automation in sales rebate processing, customer rebate settlement, Customers can achieve enhanced transparency and faster processing across the entire contract lifecycle. This innovation enables users to create and settle different types of sales rebate agreements very flexibly. Let's take a look at procurement where we digitize the invoice process to increase the productivity of accounts payment clerks. Invoices created in SAP field class are automatically posted in SAP for HANA once the invoice is in SAP has been paid. The status is seamlessly transferred to SAP Field Class. What do you get? Timely and automated payments. Now let's talk about manufacturing. First of all, the Kanban functionality for lean production control. The flexibility and visibility of manufacturing and supply chain process can be much improved. Another benefit coming with the LOB manufacturing is the integrated quality management activities during stock handling. With this update, Customers can detect non-conformities and perform necessary follow-up actions. Last but not least, analytics. Here's where you find innovation from the enhanced reporting design modeler, real-time reporting capabilities for project costs, and much more. Next for me would be 2T ERP, which is by nature one of our priorities. The complexity of an IT landscape can be reduced by deploying SAP S4 HANA Cloud to support subsidiary requirements with any of the S4 Cloud solutions connected closely to the headquarters ERP solution. Semantic integrity. Functionalities in finance, sales and intercompany are part of that scope. Check out the video from my colleague Matthias Hendley on our SAP S4 HANA playlist on YouTube for more information on this. Last but not least. What is the road ahead for S4HANA Cloud? First of all, we're planning to double the number of country versions over the next releases, covering 80% of the global key markets for our clients. Second, full focus on the line of business finance because the market is there. Many customers are asking for it. 
We also enable you to operate in a connected world with strengthening the integration capabilities to all SAP LOB solutions from Concur to Ariba and SuccessFactors. In addition, we'll continue to offer an open solution with the delivery of new APIs to drive productivity in heterogeneous IT landscapes. Finally, we'll continue to deliver key innovations in the area of machine learning with Copilot our digital assistant to further drive productivity and bring intelligence to the users. As heads up, the next release is planned for May 9th, by the way. We'll provide an early rollout information on SAP S4HANA 1705 release a few weeks prior to the release. You can find all this information on sap.com slash S4-Cloud Releases. For more information, also check out our S4HANA community and leverage SAP Learning Hub for dedicated S4 education and of course always check open.sap.com. Thanks for tuning in and see you next quarter.